Yo, 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 what is going on YouTube? MEZ back again with another video and today I'm gonna show you how to fix the AGS check engine light. As you can see, I relocated the whole motor onto the undercarriage uh, splash guard and I was thinking about like covering it up with something but honestly it's pretty safe here and you can see <clears throat> I got this new pigtail and I got this on eBay I'm gonna throw a link in the description hopefully this seller is still selling them but the uh, it has the black and the, the white wires and then instead of the two purples it's got two reds but um, yeah you, you know you're gonna have to just like mix and match until you get it right and then the screw you can see I have it right here because this is oh man <clears throat> sorry I didn't really want to take my bumper off but all right let's see if I can get my arm in here all right I'm gonna just watch this editing this arm right here once you turn your car on it's gonna move it's gonna rotate <clears throat> and this screw there's a little hole right there but it's not really for anything but you can just put the screw in there and that is going to stop the arm from being able to go the whole way and that's what's going to trick the computer into thinking that the active grill shutter is still there and this itself will not remove the check engine light but once you get those codes cleared or you um, disconnect your battery and you plug it back in the code will be gone never to return again so if you like this video and that fixed your problem go ahead and leave a like smash that subscribe button and I'll be back with more content for you guys peace